Using the join command, we can join two objects. Uh, if it's the same type, such as a line, we can join two lines if they're collinear. Collinear means that they are in the same line. So they have to be exactly, if I extend this line, it had to go exactly into that line. So to do this, we can go up and use the join command. The join command is found in the modify panel. If I hit the down arrow and go to the extend menu, come down to the bottom line, I can choose join. It'll ask me to select the source object. I'll pick the object on the left. And it'll ask me to select an object to join to that object. I'll pick this item. Then I hit enter. And this the item on the right joins the item on the left. We may join polylines as well, but they must share a common point. So here, this red polyline and this white polyline share this one point in common. If they share a point, then they're able to be joined. I'm going to go up and do that. I'm going to go to the down uh, extended menu of modify. I'm going to go to join. It'll ask me to select a source object. I'm going to pick this uh, object on this uh, red layer first, and then I'm going to select the objects to join. This is going to join the first object. So I'm going to hit enter. Notice it picks up the properties of the first object. So the first object is the object that you select. It's going to pick up those properties, and the other, the second one will join them. Now. We may also join different types of objects. So if I have, say, a arc, I'll put it from the endpoint of this uh, line here. Let me, uh, let me just put an arc here. So now I have this one polyline, and I have an arc. I may join them if they share a common point. So two objects, different types of objects may join if it shares a common point. I'm going to go to join. I'm going to select the source object. In this case, I'll pick the white object as source object. Then I'll pick the red object as the source to join. I hit enter and boom. They all go into one uh, polyline. Notice they go into a polyline. This ends up being a polyline, so since the polyline was red, it picked up the properties of the polyline. So now this is all one polyline. Okay. So using the join command, we can join similar uh, objects if they are collinear as a line. We can join a polyline if they show, uh, share a common point, and we can share. Uh, different objects if they share a common point.